opioids are actually a class of medication that are really used to soothe pain. So traditionally, many of us know opioids as Percocet or oxycodone, Vicodin or hydrocodone, morphine, fentanyl. And the way they work is they bind to certain receptors in the brain. They cause this cascade of events. And then there's this large spike in a neurotransmitter called dopamine, which is associated with pleasure, euphoria, feeling of joy. Because that dopamine spike is so high, it really causes such a euphoric feeling you can't get with other, well, with really regular activities. So when we go shopping, we hug a cuddly pet, or we have a really good meal, the dopamine naturally goes up in our brain, but it's not a match for how high the dopamine goes up when we take opioids. Is that why opioids are so addictive? That is why, Laura, yeah. They just cause such a profound reaction in the brain. They're just very potent, which is great when we use them for pain management, appropriate in consultation with the clinician. But people may want to start taking them more frequently for other things outside of just that physical pain. They want to take it to calm the emotional pain and other things that are going on in our busy, very stressful lives. And then when we keep taking them, the body actually starts to get dependent on that dopamine. So you start craving it, and actually the body becomes dependent on taking the opioid and, and the dopamine itself.